Welcome back, my YouTube family. How's everybody doing today? We got a beautiful, balming 100 degrees. It's gonna be wonderful weather to work in and do firewood activities. <laughs> Hope everybody's hanging in there. Hope everybody enjoyed my last video. Behind me is Mama Grizz working away. Today I'm gonna to share with you guys how we do our little kindling bundles. I've had a few comments pop in there, people asking how that's done. I'm gonna share with you how we, we cut up our little strips, we bundle them in our little fishnet bags and we use a piece of pvc pipe to slip the pieces down in there so that they don't catch on the side of the net bags and what you guys are going to see here in a little minute but i see mama grizz behind me cleaning up her station there Good i'm going to share everyone. i'm going to share with you guys how everything works how the operation works in this little corner of the outdoor wood shop okay so these strips come from my friend in his mill shop these are all the rippings off of the trim and molding he makes and it's all random size but some of them are three quarter by three quarter one inch by one inch half by one they're all random size and we try to we try to stick with the more you know thicker usable pieces rather than the thin paper stock here but we make a mix and there's a mix of the cherry there's oak maple in here it's it's a plethora it's all beautiful kiln dried material so no problem with that burning and also no problem traveling more than 50 miles with this stuff <laughs> but a lot of people are actually buying these little things for you know just burning a small fire because they don't want to even buy a full bundle so we've been you know what's been working out for that as well and you're gonna see mama grizz there she's gonna start cutting a bunch of them she just takes her time we have a little mark measures out 15 inches, I believe they are. Same beautiful little pieces of kindling to start your fires with. Small and easy to handle with. And who knows, maybe you buy them, just build a small project out of them. <laughs> and lines up all the edges. A little homemade outdoor miter saw station. So I drive up to my buddy's mill shop there and he loads them with the forklift just in the back of the dump trailer and I dump them off back here and set the stack of it right next to the little miter saw station with Big Bob, and then Mama Grizz takes over, and stacks a few of them at a time, kind of butts the ends of them down on the ground to make them all symmetrical and even on one end, and it gives her a starting point to start cutting in. These are our little net bags. Uh, Mama Grizz gets them off of Amazon. They just look like a little snake here, a little, a little net snake. Thank God they're not snakes, or Mama Grizz wouldn't even be touching these things. <laughs> She's got her homemade fire starters in there as well, with a egg carton, sawdust, and wax. And one of them goes in each little Kindle bundle. And here's our PVC pipe. She slips the net bag over, flips it upside right there, and then she can start stacking kindling in there. Piece of schedule 40 for strength. <laughs> oh yeah, gotta have schedule 40 PVC pipe or it won't work. <laughs> Beautiful little mix of white oak, cherry. the pipe out and makes a beautiful uniform little Kindle bundle. Fire starter on the top. Piece of wire zip tie. And they're beautiful ready for, bundle. Ready for sale. 
PVC six inch schedule 40. And then little net bags from Amazon just slip over there like, like hen poop on a pump handle. <laughs> and over right across the street from the camp wood is a little outdoor mini shed where we store them. So they're nice and high and dry. Don't have to worry about a tarp. We try to keep these really dry because obviously that's all kiln dried wood. Beautiful wheelbarrow load of product. Yeah. All right, here we go. What do you think, Mama Grizz? Do you like cutting that stuff up? I love it. <laughs> I love it. That says it right there. In next video, Mama Grizz drives the bobcat and loads logs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Seriously, I'm gonna give this video a thumbs up. We think Mama Grizz should learn how to drive Big Bob. What do you guys think? Should I do a video of Mama Grizz driving Big Bob? <laughs> you guys really want a good laugh? Oh boy, I'm glad I got insurance on it. <laughs> well, it's 8 o'clock in the morning and it's already approaching 100. <laughs> it feels like it anyhow. But I got the sombrero on. Having myself a little siesta today. <laughs> you think so? I hope you guys enjoyed that video. That's how we make our little kindling bundles. Mama Grizz, hard at it. Always busting her butts out here. She's not doing the kindling. She's overdoing the camp wood in the camp wood station. And speaking of which, we are out of bundles just about. The stand up and breeze is doing good. We might have to run up there and uh, restock that very so very shortly. Diney comes back next weekend from vacation. And that's going to do it for that one, my friends. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you guys stay safe and stay cool today. If anybody's outside doing things, make sure you stay in the shade. Don't do too much that's strenuous. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Like I always say, be kind, be good to everybody, and support your neighbors and support your friends. And Mama Grizz, you want to you wanna cut it out? <laughs> everybody <laughs> thanks for each and every one of your guys's comments and likes and supports and we appreciate all of that kind of stuff and keep doing it my friends and until then we'll see you on the next one see you later everybody